Yo, what is going on, y'all? We are out here today. It's the kickoff of season 45, war number one. We got Pom Pom in here, too. Spooky did not want to be in the intro. He's out somewhere. He's actually right by my leg. He got jealous of Pom Pom. But yeah, dude, we are kicking it off today for Loki's up against DSV Gene War number one. And it's a very important season. Hulk and Titania are blacklisted, but Ghost is whitelisted. And I did just send my ghost, bro. So we're going to be taking her to war today. It's going to be pretty sick, dude. Um, unfortunately, we are also bringing Herc. Don't get me wrong, dude. I, I like playing Herc. He's just so expensive, dude. Like, <laughs> you're probably not going to die with him. But it's going to cost you a lot of potions. Um, yeah, so that's the team today. Ghost, Wasp, and Herc. Um, ghost and Herc are rank 5 and Ascended, which is pretty dope. Um, yeah, I really don't want to die with them. That would be kind of embarrassing to... Uh, have the strongest champs possible in the game and die. Oh, actually, rank threes are possible now, so there's only one in the game. Uh, but whatever, dude. Um, we're starting off on path nine. We have this void here. There's literally nothing to worry about. We have ghost. Um, I'm not even gonna gray boost. I'm trying to save those this time because uh, we have the loyalty seven star crystals in the store. So I'm gonna try not to use as much loyalty. Which, I'm bringing Herc today, so obviously I'm going to be using some. But I only have two Herc fights, so it's not going to be that crazy. If I had like a full like 10 fight Herc war, that would that would run me like 200,000 loyalty. Which I don't want to spend. Um, but yeah, we have Mantis here now. This is also super straightforward. Um, she has Power Focus 1, Feats of Indestructible 1. So you really don't want a Power, power Back Boost here. Uh, she just blocked me there. I don't know how. I thought I was not being that slow. But at least I didn't get parried. Um, yeah, that's whatever, dude. So we're using Light Attacks here because we're trying to limit Mantis' power while we build up to Special 2. And I'm trying to get some debuffs on me. I got, like, really bad RNG, no debuffs there, which kind of sucks. But it's cool. Hopefully we got some better debuffs there. We got some. We throw a niche. and I die. And yeah, that's, that's Ghost. It's not a Ghost, dude. Um, yeah, it's cool because you don't even need to bring Hood on the team when you have an Ascended Ghost. Because they all just die. Like, in a one special two, typically. So, I mean, that's typically how it goes with Hazard Shift and Ghost. Unless you get bad RNG, which I did on that first combo, but the second combo was better. Um, yeah, so if you don't get enough debuffs on the first combo, just do it again. Hopefully you get better RNG. I don't know, man. It's cool. Yeah, but we haven't used any pots yet, I think. Maybe I used one. I don't know. I wasn't keeping track. But yeah, t Ghost Wars are usually pretty cheap because she ends up the fight so fast and she usually doesn't take recoil damage um right there pretty bad rp and no debuffs again so i was like dude what's going on here um and no debuffs again so yeah this fight's not going as planned but it's fine i just get it from a special three i'm just gonna throw it then build up to a special two again which is kind of annoying but it's whatever also man dog is like okay Oh, he's not decay sorry he's sugar pill and ghost isn't decay but it doesn't really matter dude um we're just still gonna ghost them ghost doesn't really care so yeah here we're gonna get a bunch of debuffs on us now that's kind of cool but now we're kind of losing some health and that was a fat special too so you didn't even make it past the first hit um yeah so i lost a bit of health there from like all the debuffs of course you get it when you don't really want to but it's whatever dude it is whatever um, last path fight, we got this Morbius here. Okay, yeah, so that was my first potion. So I used one potion on Ghost so far. Um, we're gonna reboost, just small boost. I think this was like right before bed the night before. I just wanted to get him out of the way so I could move up, burn some energy, and then not have to energy refill in the morning. I'm also trying not to energy refill right now because we have the Necropolis coming up next week, so I really need to save my units for that. So yeah, this is one of the few wars where I don't just energy boost all the way through. Usually, like last season, every single war, I would just burn energy refills because I had, like, hella units to spare. Uh, but yeah, anyways, you have Morbius here. He's being kind of annoying. You see how he backed up a whole bunch there? That was stupid. Um, now he is being kind of annoying again. You don't want to parry him here because this has one eye open. So, yeah, we're just hoping he plays into us, which he is now, finally. That's better. We just need to phase one more hit. And then... Do we get some debuffs? Yeah, we got debuffs. We're gonna throw it. He's gonna die. That's over, dude. Um, yeah, Ghost is a... She's a pretty good champ. Love when she's whitelisted, dude. It happens once every three seasons. Um, yeah, so that's the path fights. Moving on now. We have this Gore here. This is the Power Snack. Power Sting node. Um, I think that's it. Yeah. Basically. Um, so yeah. He's gonna power sting you when he gets a bar of power. 
he's gonna almost gain a full bar of power whenever you trigger a buff which is fine dude it's gore i mean it's ghost versus gore um all you really have to do here is just like get him to throw a special one which he's gonna throw here i think yeah good gore um ideally you would want to power start once you can get out of there faster because if he doesn't throw a special you might get cornered and that's kind of bad um here he's being kind of nice though but then yeah power stack's a little bit annoying getting a lot of power things and stuff but it's whatever it is free healing i guess but i'm gonna block some hits here so i can get some debuffs on me i think i blocked the last part yeah and then block again hit him throw my special two so i took a little bit of power some damage there which as i was expected i plan to do that I just wanted to get the fight over with and just throw it while I had like all the debuffs on me, so he died. Um, yeah, Ghost is pretty good for Gore. Uh, power attack doesn't matter, you don't need the cruelty when you have like 10 Furies. So yeah. Um, next up we have this Dark Hawk here, and this is the whole reason why I brought Herc. Initially I wanted to just bring Hood, which I didn't really need because I never took reroll damage the whole war, I think. Um, but yeah, we had this Dark Hawk here, we didn't know what to do, so I was like screw it, I'll just Herc him. Um, so it kind of sucks that Herc is on ramp, so I have to ramp him up at the beginning of the fight here. So I'm going to kind of do like what I do in Battlegrounds. You parry, you go back up, light, 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 back up, light. <laughs> you just keep on doing that until you got some good ramp going on. Right here I'm trying to throw my special one without dexing, but I accidentally dex so I screwed up. Because the thing about uh, the tactic Darkhawk is uh, Sugar Pill, whenever a buff expires on you, he has a 35% chance to go unstoppable. So... Yeah, you really don't want to mess around with dexing too much. Um, so right here, I'm just going to pull the block. I'm going to knock him down with a heavy attack now. I took a couple combos, which is fine. I'm still going to get out of the fight. Um, we throw the special three. It's going gonna, it's gonna to do some damage now. We, we took off his protection. We're decently ramped up. And yeah, this is going to do some damage. Then we're going to do some combos after. He should die pretty quick here. Now, now that the protection is down, we're like pretty ramped up. I'm going to wait for shield mode to come off, which... It's kind of annoying, but I don't- I wanted to throw my special 1 so I would have the, uh, true sense, but that didn't happen, so it's fine, special 3. You really don't want to throw a special 2 here, because the special 2 stuns him, and then you take just a fat chunk of burst damage right after that, because of one eyed open. So, yeah, that's why I didn't do that here, I went for the special 3 instead. But yeah, now Darkhawk's dead, um, pretty, pretty chill fight, besides that first part where I got cornered and kept on screwing up somehow, um, yeah. I really don't like fighting Darkhawk, like it's not that hard, it's just annoying because I have to bring Herc and I really don't want to do that, <laughs> but it's fine dude. Uh, moving on, we have this Doctor Doom here, and we have Ghost, this is Hazard Shift. So we're going to heal her up a little bit, we took some power sink damage from Gore, a little bit of debuff damage too, um, so a couple potions, that's fine dude. Now we are going to, we still have the Invul on from the last fight. Now we're just going to go in there and smash. I do have a power back boost just in case he doesn't die. Doom has a chance to like make you not crit even though you have guaranteed crits. Which is kind of stupid because I mean they're supposed to be guaranteed. But I don't know. Doom just... He's Doom. Um, it's whatever though. So yeah, just in case that happens, I have a power back boost in case I need to throw it again. Uh, but yeah, we got some decent debuffs here. We get a fat one. That hit didn't crit, but the next hit does crit, so it's fine. He still died. Waste of a power back boost, but it's cool. Better safe than sorry, dude. Better safe than sorry. Now moving on. We have this Nova here. Um, I'm gonna have to heal a perk for this fight, which I didn't want to do. Um, it's fine, though. <laughs> yeah, so I healed the perk a good amount. Um, not all the way, though. I'm just gonna pop a combat regen boost just so I can get a little bit more healing in there. Um, don't really need it though. This is a rank 4 Nova, so he's gonna die very, very fast. We're not even a ramped up perk. We have like two feats, I think. And then, yeah, so we're gonna heavy him here. Um, get auto block there, try to intercept him there. That didn't work out, but that worked out. Um, yeah, so now we're just gonna try to bait special ones ideally, because this node does have the blockable special 2, which can find dex in his special 2. But, I mean, if he's gonna throw a special 1, I'm, I'd rather just dex that, it's easier. Um, but, I mean, either way, it doesn't really matter. I also have a greater special 3 defense boost in case I need to push him there, in case he gets stingy, keep on dashing back and forth. But it doesn't matter, dude, he is dead, and Herc wins. And only two Herc fights, so we didn't use too many potions. He did take a couple after that Dark Hog fight, but it's whatever. Um, we're moving on to this Bishop now. And we're going to be using Ghost here. Ghost is a decent Bishop counter, uh, believe it or not. So this has Conflictor. 
be a combat deja vu prowess. Um, yeah. So I'm going to try to alternate my mediums and lights. And I'm going to try to push him to special one. And then just uh, use the incinerates from that to uh, get a bunch of furies. And hopefully kill him in one special two. If we don't kill him in one special two, then we have a power back boost. So that's going to be fine. Um, I dexed the last part too early, so I ate it. So that's fine. I don't really care. Uh, we're getting some intense on us now. That's cool. We're going to throw a special two. He is going to die. So yeah. Ghost versus Bishop, pretty good matchup. Um, yeah, solid champ. And that was our war, dude. That was it was pretty solid. Um, good stuff. Good first war. And yeah, actually, our battle group ended up getting a donut. We went fifty and zero, which is which is a good start to the season, dude. Very good start. And overall, we actually only died twice as an alliance. So that that's pretty pretty good, man. Um, typically. The way our seasons go, we have a really bad start. We die like 10 times in the first war. <laughs> but then we get better over time uh, as we get more used to it, get back in the groove of things. But yeah, we had a really good start to the season. And hopefully it only goes up from here, man. We we might have a we might have a pretty good shot this season, man. So yeah, yeah, this war looks like a W for us. And hope hopefully we can keep it up, dude. But yeah, anyways, I appreciate y'all watching, y'all. Take care.